This sports segment of Naperville News 17 is brought to you by your local YMCA. For youth development, for healthy living, for social responsibility. Coming into the ninth and final week of the high school football season, five of the local Naperville schools had already punched their ticket to the playoffs. North, Central, Nequa, Wabonzi, and Bennett. That leaves just Mattia, which controls its own destiny. With a win Friday night, the Mustangs would also join the party. Blaze Bell warming up for the Mustangs in this must-win situation for Mattia Valley. Down 14-3, Bell finds Nick Dotson in the corner of the end zone to cut the lead to four. But that would be the closest the Mustangs would get in this one. Jonathan Pfizer rumbles right up the middle on the ensuing drive to push the lead back to 10. And then in the third, Pfizer seals the deal with his third touchdown of the night. This one from 52 yards out. Wabonzi ends Matias' season with the 55-10 blowout victory. On to the Crosstown Classic at Benedetti Worley. Neighborville North looking to improve to 6-3 on the year over rival Neighborville Central. But this one was all red and white. 7-3 Central and Jake Colby extends the lead with the keeper. 14-3 Red Hawks. Third quarter now, Colby does it through the air this time, finding Michael Colzo for the 17-yard TD strike, 26-3. Red Hawks go on to win this one, 39-17. Going into the first week of the playoffs, first and 7A, Bennett Academy will travel to Mount Carmel at Gately Stadium this weekend. And in the 8A pairings, Naperville North will travel to Wabonzi Valley. Downers Grove South at Naperville Central and O'Fallon will take on Nequa Valley. On Saturday night, the Naperville Central soccer team hit the road to Matia Valley and looked to secure its third straight regional title with a win over the Mustangs. It'd be a busy night for Tim Howard in net. Scoreless into the 15th minute until Ben Border finesses one into the back of the net. 1-0 Red Hawks. Second half action now 2-0. Naperville Central would tack on one more with this David Murphy goal. Central goes on to win the regional. For the first time since the Elizabeth Lumpkin era at Naperville Central, a Red Hawk captured the girls' singles tennis state championship. Tiffany Chen defeated Hinsdale Central freshman Isabella Lorenzini in Buffalo Grove over the weekend in straight sets. The sophomore is the first Red Hawk to win state since Lumpkin won four in a row from 2000 to 2003. I'm just super excited right now. I mean, I didn't come in thinking that I was going to win. I was just coming out to play well, but I mean, this is a really nice bonus. Last year, I came in as a little freshman, not really expecting to win anything. Yeah, there's, I felt no pressure last year, but this year I had a little more pressure because I had to repeat my uh, four, fourth place or at least something like that. But then, um, yeah, I think I played pretty well this year too. That's all for sports. Back to you, Jen.